Hello, this was another tutorial, the second video in the My Desktop series, and in this, I will be teaching you how to do this. It's a really neat program, and it really can help keep you organized. So, what it's called is Yodum 3D. I just made a shortcut for it so that I have everything in this folder. Um, I personally like it over the Shock 4-Way 3D. I will do a video on that, and I will give my thoughts there as well. I also have the newer desk space, but I will also be doing a video on that later. Alright, so on this video, I'll be focusing on Yodum 3D which is the older version of Desk Space before they got bought out. Alright, so I have here an internet and this is where I downloaded it. The link is right here. I will be putting it in the YouTube description. And yeah, you just click uh, the Softpedia Download US and that will bring it to this. And then you run this program all the way down here, this one, and it'll... Well, I already have it open, so and that's what it'll open. So, let's see. Drag this up. Oops, you see my bar there, maybe. Um, anyways, right-click, Options. We got the... Hotkey activation, I have it as shift and control, so whenever I press shift and control at the same time, it'll give the effect. Um, zoom, I just left that at default. Again, default and put this on your language, so I'm obviously English and I'm speaking it, so then I click OK. Save all your details. <coughs> and drag this back down. And yeah, so. It's basically an overview of Yodum 3D. I think it's an awesome program. It definitely helps to keep you organized. You're allowed to have backgrounds on each of them. So, I find it's an awesome way to keep organized. So, I, I use this one for my schoolwork, this one for music, my everyday stuff, and I still haven't found a use for this one yet. Alright, well, thanks for watching. As I said before, I will also be doing a video on uh, where is it? Right here. Uh, Shock 4-Way 3D and the newer version of Yodum Desk Space. And yeah, look forward also to this doc, um, this effect. And yeah, so thanks for watching. This is another tutorial by Tut Guy. I uh, thank you.